Naitwa Chira Brian Chira. Tap tap your screen stop tap. Watu walikuwa fikiria nitaozea jela. Hello my singulars na my plurals. Welcome back again to my YouTube channel. These is trends with the smile. Siku ya leo pia tunaongelea kuhusiana na story ambayo imeweza ku trend for this week. Story ya Brian Chira na Asia na Senya. Sitaongelea kuhusiana na hiyo story kwa sababu already mshasikia. Na Brian Chira pia ameweza kuwa released. As mnaona <laughs> alisema kuna wale ambao wanatarajia ataozea ataozea huko ajelani lakini ashatoka ameweza kuachiliwa na cash bail ya 50000 na the reason as to why branch ile aliweza kuwa arrested kwa wale ambao hawakuwa na habari branch ile aliweza kushikwa kwa sababu ya reason ya cyberbullying na pia defamation unaona i, th- I hope mumeona hiyo video Uh, Aziad pia kuongelelea kuhusiana na hayo lakini just jana aliweza kuwa interview na Andrew Kibe na kwa hiyo interview ameweza ku explain mambo mingi sana sababu ya yeye kuwa arrested na kuna story zingine pia uh, zimeweza kutokea kuhusiana na hiyo after yeye kuachiliwa uh, Branchira anasoma anasoma uh, chuo kikuu cha Kabarak University na vile ana explain hapa hebu tusikie stu, ni sababu gani ameweza kuwa suspended kwa sababu kuna story ambapo uh, yeye amekuwa suspended kutoka uh, from Kabarak University hebu tumsikie well, hey, 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 slow down you've been suspended from university yes i've been suspended right now because of what they say i've been purporting because Kabarak motto is biblical perspective yeah, ameweza kupeana the reason as to why Kabarak University ameweza wameweza kumsuspend yeye yeah, ni kwa sababu ni mambo za biblical unaona wao wana wana teach according to mambo za biblical yeye yeah, yeah, kutoka kwa live huko online kutuhusiana watu kuita hizo majina ziko against their 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 rules sawa sawa na story zingine ni kuhusiana tu na branch ira tunajua urafiki kati yake na uh, huyu jamaa anajiita Prince Mwiti. Prince Mwiti hata kuna time yenye uh, Chira alikuanga jela, alimwambia nini? Amletee kitu ya kuvaa na ARVC yake kwa sababu ye ako mgonjwa. Uh, alimpigia simu ampeleke. Lakini kidogo kidogo tukasikia ndio huyo sasa ya Prince Mwiti kitu anasema mnasikia vile mnasikia hapa eh? Wacha wakusaidie na uende hizo earrings kwa sababu unaadvisiwa kama mjinga. Enda hizo earrings, jua wewe unajifanya unajua sana. Uko adole ya ku, ni kama kuna beef kati yake na Branchira kwa sababu Prince Mwiti alimwambia Branchira apologize kwa Aziad. Ni kama nani aku react vizuri Branchira aku react vizuri. So hapa Prince Mwiti tunapata kwamba wanabishana. So kuna beef kati ya Prince Mwiti na Branchira. So hata Prince Mwiti tunaweza kumtafuta, tuweze kusikia uh, kutoka kwake pia. Na pia watu wameweza kuwa na reaction tofauti tofauti kuhusiana na historia ya Branchira na Azir na Senya. Wengi wakisema kwamba Branchira ameongea ukweli. Kuna ka ukweli hapa. Kwa sababu gani Aziad tu ni jamaa tu ni Klauchesa anaongelea leo ameongelea hii eh, juzi kuna time alikuwa amesema eh, mulamoa amewacha ame, ame kumgreet eh, ali, kwa public kunaona amekataa kumsalimia amekataa kupiga picha na yeye hizo story pia zikaenea so ni jamaa tu ni Klauchesa mbona anaichukulia serious wakenya wengi wamejitokeza wakisema kwamba kuna ka ukweli hapa ndani mimi sijui ni ka ukweli gani kiko hapa lakini wanasema kuna ka ukweli wengine wengine wakiegemea upande wa Branchira wengine pia wakisema kwamba Aziad ni brand kubwa unaona Aziad ni brand kubwa kwa sababu anything mtu atasema against yeye itaweza kumletia shida that's why aliweza ku react mapema lakini kuna wengine wanasema kwa sababu kwa hiyo live ya Branchira ni watu elfu kumi walikuwa wana watch yeah? so hiyo story ya kumuita malaya ama kuita hizo majina zingesikika tu na hawa watu 10k aingeenda hivyo worldwide ange angeshikile hiyo story ange angecheza chini lakini baada after yeye kumshika ni nini sasa hiyo story imeenea kila mali ati ameemployiwa juu ya hii story na hii story so hizo story zote zimeenea wengine wakisema acheze chini wengine wakiegemea waki upande wa branchira wengine wakimsupport 
Aziad kufanya hivyo kwa sababu yeye ni brand kuna reaction tofauti ya wa Kenya hebu tuone hii video tif kuna kwa ukweli hapo because kama inamuuma mbona uende ushike mtu kama brand brand ila ni kijana hey, kijana wa msichana <laughs> alafu pia kuna video yenye ilikuwa inaegemea on the side of Aziad hebu tuone hii Samanzi. Mm. Brianchira Juzi alikuwa online akisema oh mulamwali ni nyima sijui picha nini nini. Brianchira ni cloud chaser. Aziad ni dem amejenga brand yake. Mm. Aziad ni dem mwenye ana inspire a lot of young girls. Sawa. So Brianchira akiingia All right. Guys, uh, new story nimeweza kukuletea siku ya leo na ile story imetokelezea kuhusiana na Brianchira ni kwamba amekuwa suspended from Kabarak University. So guys, is it right? ni kitu ambacho inafaa Kabarak University kuchukua hiyo step na kumfanya huyu branchira hivyo branchira anafaa kufanya nini unaona so kwa sababu hii kesi yake pia iko kwa hearing eh, eh? so hii kesi yake pia haijaisha ni ameachiliwa na bond ya uh, cash bill ya 50000 kesi yake bado haijaisha anafaa kufanya nini sawa sawa is it right Kabarak University ku suspend Uh, branchira so branchira pia anafaa kufanya nini na uli tuweze kupata maoni yako you can share with us through the comment section na utaweza kutuelezea so guys eh, ni hayo tu niko nayo kwa sasa kama wewe ni returning subscriber thank you so much na kama ni mara yako ya kwanza please consider to like share and subscribe till we meet next time bye bye